I'm about to post ask me a question on my story. How the f are you so pretty and handsome at the same time, G? I was just at McDonald's. They gave me this hard brick sandwich. The manager is basically spitting in my face. I'm waiting for the police to come. And why the f would they give you a hard brick sandwich? Like, that's why you don't go to McDonald's. You know what? Don't even worry about it. I'm gonna handle them. <laughs> Hello, hello. Before we even start this video, I'm gonna do my intro real quick because I always forget to do my intro. But if you're new to my channel, hi, my name is Kaya or Kai for short. This channel is full of good vibes, lit music, lit energy. So make sure you subscribe if you enjoy the video, okay? Only if you enjoy the video. Anyway, oh child, I'm back at it doing some bullshit, bro. I'm, at, I'm back at it doing some BS, bro. I'm sorry. Last 24 hour challenge I did was, if you guys have not seen that, by the way, I'm gonna leave an iCard, but it was the 24 hours without a phone challenge. Ooh! Baby, that was torture. I'm not gonna lie. That was torture. I mean the video speaks for itself If you have not seen it, you should go watch it. But you know, I'm up for the challenge. I love a good challenge I feel like I'm a challenge type of girl. So today we are gonna be spending 24 hours in no other place than my closet now look, I don't even know if I'm gonna do 24 hours for this because I actually have things to do this weekend. Like, it's 7.50 p.m. and I have things to do this weekend, it's a Friday, so I might not even spend 24 hours. I'm not one of them YouTubers, bro, that lies, bro. I'm, don't put no boo in sound effect, bro. I'm not one of them YouTubers who lie, say 24 hour challenge, and they don't actually do the challenge because I could sit here and lie to y'all right now and tell y'all like I spent 24 hours in here when I really didn't. So I'm not gonna lie to y'all, bro. But I know for a fact we're gonna spend the night in here, okay? It's gonna be a little, you know, a little vibe. At least I'm not lying to y'all bro damn anyway y'all it's 7 51 p.m i am about to basically prepare i prepare for this video like i clean my closet vacuumed and everything because i don't need no no dust bunny hopping on my face at night and i'm thinking it's a fucking spider but i prepared my closet and you know it's gonna be a little it's gonna be a little vibe we're gonna get some blankets make it real comfy cozy i probably could fit my futon in here Nah, that's doing too much, bro. That's doing too much. Let's start with getting our setup prepared. Here's my closet now. Why the fuck is this bin breaking? Bro, I'm just gonna leave it, bro, because I'm not fixing it. But here's my closet now. Um, you know, nice and clean. Random shit above there. Comfy, cozy, comfy, cozy. A lot of space in here. If you watch my furnished apartment tour, you already seen this, but yeah, that's basically the closet. First things first, we need snacks. I don't want to hear nothing. Oh, why would I spend the night in an empty closet with no snacks? Like, dude, that's what I'm not Standing. Of course I need snacks, bro. Let's see what I'm gonna bring, y'all. Damn, do I even have snacks? Y'all in my house eating my shit. We're gonna throw all our snacks in this bag, okay? Let's see, let's see what we got. Oh, it's not looking like that much up in here, I'm not gonna lie. I was on live with my friend the other day. He talking about you eating artificial cheese. That, free, that cheese don't even need to be refrigerated. That's so unhealthy. <laughs> Who cares about health, bro? Like, I'm just, I'm so sorry. Like, I'm not tolerating y'all to eat 10 bags of Takis a day, but you can eat a little uh, spray cheese if you feeling like it, bro. Who am I to judge? Let me get these hot Cheetos in the bag. Hello. Am I gonna wanna eat seaweed, y'all? Seaweed in the bag. Okay, we got a bag full of salty shit. Let's find something sweet that we can put in here. Fridge real empty. I bought a Slim Jim earlier from the store, so let's go ahead and add that in. And of course, we need this. Hold on. Now we got our bag of snacks. No, y'all can't get none. Let me take a shot of Celsius real quick. I bought this earlier too. Mm, just tastes like. That's how it tastes, bro. I'm so sorry, that's how it tastes to me. Now let's walk around the crib and try to find things that aren't food that I'm gonna need, AKA AirPods going in the bag. And in case those AirPods die, I got my Beats. Put those around my neck. Damn, my neck too fat. Laptop, of course. Hold on, y'all, my arm getting heavy. Damn, this shit heavy as shit. What the hell? Let's go ahead and get a book. I'm finna read this book. What else could I get that's gonna entertain me? I have no idea. MacBook charger, of course. Why am I forgetting that? I also need my phone charger. Aquaphor. Don't ask, bro, don't ask. Last things first, I, what? First things last, I, what? Last thing I need, last thing I need is an extension cord because how I'ma charge my phone, bro? How I'ma charge my shit? What am I supposed to do now? I feel like this lighting making me look sweaty as hell, but maybe I am sweaty as hell. I have not fixed up like my section and like set my blanket out and did all of that yet, so maybe I should. Or maybe I should just lay right here. Did I get a text message? Cause my phone on D&D, so like when your phone on D&D, sometimes the messages don't really come through. No, I didn't. 
y'all what am i supposed to do bro like literally what am i supposed to do i didn't prepare like this little shit that i brought ain't like what what is this gonna do this little bullshit book actually the book is not bullshit bro but like i'm just not in the mood to read right now what am I supposed to do, bro? I'm gonna say this the whole video, y'all. What the hell am I supposed to do? Let me at least not complain because I've been in here literally five minutes, dude. But, like, let me at least fix up my area, make it look nice, comfy, neat, aesthetic. Let me at least do that. It's hot as shit up in here. Damn! I could turn the AC... Wait, there's no vents in here. I'm about to free. I'm about to burn up, bro. Kebab, kebab, kebab. I was finna turn on the AC because I, I could turn on the AC through my phone. Kebab, bro. I'm finna be grilled. There's no, there's no vents up in here, bro. What the fuck? Guys, I'm extremely bored. Um, what the hell am I supposed to do? Like, leave some suggestions. Wait, this video is not live, so the challenge is already over by the time you're seeing it. Um, yeah, this is so good. Thank you guys for suggesting this video. Thank you. Thank you. Peace and love. Thank you so much. I'm about to post Ask Me a Question on my story, but if I get some outlandish shit, I'm gonna let y'all know, because people be saying some crazy shit. I'm not gonna lie, bro. And you know what photo I'm gonna post? I'm gonna post this photo for the Ask Me a Question. Look. Comment a uh, red heart emoji if you've seen this post on my Instagram. Also, follow my Instagram if you're not following my Instagram. Duh. Okay, y'all. So, it's been like maybe 15 minutes. And I just wanted to share with you guys some of the fucking replies that I got on this Ask Me A Question that I just posted on my Instagram. Bruh. Listen, listen. Just listen, y'all. OMG, you're so pretty. Do you have alopecia? What the fuck? Current favorite song. People don't even realize that I'm not answering these questions publicly. I'm answering them on this video, so. Sorry, bruh. Context clues. Y'all should've used our context clues. I said for a YouTube video, bruh. Current favorite song. Let's see. I think it would have to be, uh, Maybe She by Still Woozy. I'm not gonna play it because I'm not trying to get copyrighted. Not trying to get that ass smack, bruh. I'm trying to get my money on. But Maybe She by Still Woozy. Just go listen to it. It's such a magnificent song. Do you see yourself collaborating with YouTubers and meeting with them in LA? No, and let me tell you why. I'm not trying to get possessed. It's really that simple. But listen, listen, a lot of YouTubers are cool. You feel me? I'm mutuals with a lot of YouTubers, but a lot of them being cults and shit, like, like you really don't know how someone is living, bro. People be lying on the internet. I feel like I would just rather do things on my own. Like, if I met a friend or whatever, and we've been friends for a while, then we wanted to link up and collab, then that would be great. But at the moment, I'm just really trying to do my own thing, okay? Next, how long does it usually take you to edit? It takes me at least like six or seven hours. At least. So please like the video because I be in there grinding. I be grinding, bro. It takes forever. How the fuck are you so pretty and handsome at the same time, G? Dude, what the fuck? Why did it take you so long to start consistently posting on YouTube again? I was fucking depressed. You ever just be in the rain and want to fuck a dude? I'm not doing this no more, I swear. I'm not doing this no more. I'm deleting the post, bro. Y'all not ever put in nothing normal. The normalest comment was, what's your favorite song? Did you ever get your BBL done or did you do... What? Did you get your BBL done or did you work for it? Either way, it looks good. Are you okay? You're not like the rest of us, are you? Best sneaky link interaction, bro. You have to be five years old. I'm so sorry. You have to be six years old asking me questions like this. I'm praying for you immediately. That's a wrap. Y'all, I'm so bored. I hope I'm not, like, extremely loud. First of all, I'm looking like a fucking marshmallow. I'm just realizing with this all-white-ass outfit. Anywho, I've just been sitting here chilling, watching Mai's new video, and I'm bored shitless, bro. I don't know what I expected, bro. Fingers stained red from the hot Cheetos I was just eating. Also, since there's absolutely nothing else to do, let's have a dance. Dance sesh, dance sesh. Now I know you guys are not gonna be able to hear the music, which, sorry, but I will link my Apple Music in the description. I always link my Apple Music in the description. A lot of y'all be asking, but yeah, let's have a dance sesh, burn some cow, and listen to some music in the closet. Yes, in the closet. Wrote this rhyme straight across, clowns sort of take a loss. You know they jealous if behind his back they ever say he's soft. Spin back around quick. Confront him, then they play it off. Young and the world is full of it. Forge ahead, stay the course. At the bar, who's buying? Been in the game so long. <laughs> Why did that not tell me that was a bad idea? I'm dripping sweat right now, and I was only dancing for like 10 minutes. Especially considering what I told y'all earlier about how there's no AC, bruh. Open up this closet door, but we need some air. Damn. I'm trying to talk it out. And you talking about a little baby in his restaurant. Fuck!
Oh, little baby, his restaurant. This angle makes me look like a mashed potato, bro. Anyway, I'm about to spend the next hour or so doing something really important. You guys probably wouldn't understand, but I'm just gonna focus and prioritize some things that are really important right now. So I'll probably be doing that for the next hour. This. This is what I'll be doing for the next hour. Well, the challenge is not going how I thought, duh. I don't know what I was thinking, but I usually wouldn't even be tired right now. It is 10.43 p.m. and I am getting tired. I already used the bathroom and I gave myself this minute rule that I have to use the bathroom for a minute. And my bathroom, if you do not know, is right outside of my closet. Like, it's literally connected. So, I feel like technically that's not really, like, cheating because the bathroom is right outside the door. But I, ha I only have a minute to go. And I already went, bro. I already went. Which also means that later I'm going to have one minute to do my skincare routine. So... That's great. I want to do this like prank thing that I saw someone do on TikTok where it's like they put the McDonald's background noise and they just say some crazy shit and send a voice message. I seen someone do it and they said that they worked at McDonald's. They were sending it to a guy and I can't do that. So I'm just going to troll my friends and come up with something top of my head. This is the sound effect, I think. This is the sound effect. Okay, I'm gonna just have it playing and then I'm gonna just send something to my friend. He has my location though, which sucks and I hope he doesn't check my location. I'm gonna send it to my friend Ja first. I don't know what I'm gonna say, I'm gonna just make it up. Ja, bro, tell me why the fuck I'm at McDonald's and these gave me a fucking burger that was hard as shit. And I'm over here like, bro, I'm not eating this. This shit is hard as fuck. It literally was a brick, Ja. Like, I'm actually pissed off. It was a brick. They didn't even cook it. It was frozen. So I got mad and... Hold on, hold on. I almost cracked. I got mad at the drive-thru and they told me to come in. And I'm sitting here waiting on the manager. The manager started yelling at me and, like, basically spitting in my fucking face. Now I'm mad and I'm waiting for the police to come. Because what the fuck? Please just send a voice message back, bro. I can't even fucking reply. Like, my mom's gonna call me right now, so I'm gonna respond later. Just send one back, bro. Let's see if he falls for it. <laughs> this nigga already answered. He said, bro, what? With some laughing emojis, then he sent the voice message. Let's see what he said. Bro, how did that happen? Like, so they gave you, so they gave you brick food. They gave you hard food, and they got mad. You better sue. Sue, 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 sue. Sue, 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 sue. <laughs> All right, let me send it to my group chat my, with my family, bro. Bro, why the fuck am I, like, I'm actually pissed off. I'm actually finna fucking cry, bro. Why the fuck I was just at McDonald's getting a burger, a Big Mac, and some nuggets. They gave me this hard-ass brick sandwich, y'all. The sandwich is a, literally a brick. Hold on, I'm gonna send another one. They gave me a fucking brick sandwich, so I'm irritated at the drive-thru. They like, oh, come in, come in, we gonna make you another one. I get, I go in the McDonald's. The manager is basically yelling at my in my face, bro. Niggas spitting in my face. And I'm getting hot, too. I'm waiting for the fucking police to come. I'm on the phone with my mama right now. She's finna call, so she keep telling me that I keep declining her calls. But please just send a voice message back. I don't... I'm gonna check it when I check it. All right, let me hear how that sound. That one sounded kind of good. Bro, why the fuck am I... Like, I'm actually pissed off. I'm actually finna fucking cry, bro. <laughs> why the fuck I was just at McDonald's getting a burger, a Big Mac, and some nuggets... They gave me this hard-ass brick sandwich, y'all. The sandwich is a, literally a brick. Bro, I'm such a good actor. My niece, Brian, texted in our group chat. She said, no fucking way. Now, let's go back to what my friend Josh said. He said something else. Hold on. You better than me, because, nigga, if that was me, I would have been going stupid in that motherfucker. I would have been going crazy. <laughs> Oh my god. I want to do it to my friend Brack, but he's too smart and he's going to catch on. So, y'all, my niece Keisha responded. Let's see what she said. That big fat nigga, uh, manager needs to sit his <laughs> down because I know that. <laughs> um, and why the <laughs> would they give you a hard ass brick sandwich? Like, what's wrong with them? That's why you don't go to McDonald's. <sighs> Hold on. You know what? Don't even worry about it. I'm going to handle them. <laughs> Um, and why the fuck would they give you a hard ass brick sandwich? Like, what's wrong with them? That's why you don't go to McDonald's. <sighs> Hold on. You know what? Don't even worry about it. I'ma handle them. <laughs> I'm gonna have to bleep out damn near everything she said, bro, because she said some crazy shit. W acting, bro. That I'm literally so good at acting, bro. I'm going to try to do my friend Brax, even though I just told y'all that he's not gonna fall for it. Let's try it anyway. Let me get in my acting bag. Bro, why the fuck? I'm actually, like, I'm actually finna cry, bro. 
Why the fuck was I just at McDonald's, right? I was getting a Big Mac, bro. Fuck the challenge at this point. I was getting a Big Mac and some nuggets. They gave me a brick ass. A brick ass. It wasn't even cooked, Brax. It was frozen. <laughs> bro, so I'm over here mad as shit in the drive-thru. And they like, oh, just come through the, uh, come, come inside, basically. I go inside and I'm like basically mad about my food. And the manager damn near starts spitting in my fucking face, bro. Like, I'm actually finna cry. My mom, I'm waiting for my mom to come up here because they over here saying that the police finna come and I need to wait. Because I was arguing with the manager. Can you um send a voice message back? Because I'm finna be on the phone with my mom and I just need you to send one back so I can see it when I'm done. Does that sound believable, y'all? Let me know, let me know. I'm such a good actor, dude. Dude, I should've been on Nickelodeon. Okay, my friend Brax replied back. I told y'all he's real smart, so he might not even go for it. And plus, he has my location. But let's see what he said. I'm trying to be serious about this, but like, girl. Imagine calling the cops at, it's like 11 o'clock for you. Your mom coming up to a McDonald's at 11 o'clock because the cops was called. Y'all would've got the fuck up out of there. I'm sorry. Cause like they can't, they can't legally hold you there. He always trying to dissect a lab report, bro. Just give a crazy reaction, bro. Be like, oh my God, bro. What the fuck happened? You over here talking about something that legally, the cops can't legally, legally, legally at least pretend to be scared for me or something legally damn he already figuring it out y'all he over here typing pause with all caps can i send a voice message back because you're gonna be on the phone with your mom but how is you supposed to hear the voice message if, if you're on the phone with your mom i'm not trying to say you like lying because like you actually sound like mad as shit but like that don't make no sense because i'm a good actor my nigga damn. he didn't even think to check my location because he knew oh shit she's mad as shit so automatically this is real i was just trying to be empathetic to the fact that you might actually be mad so i didn't want to like you know press on no nerves i didn't want to press on no nerves press on these balls bro you didn't know you want to be detective Specializing oh so so bad, bro. You didn't know, bro. Should I send that or no? I'm not gonna send it, y'all. I don't wanna press on no nerves. Press on these balls, bro. You didn't know. You wanna be detective. Who voice is that, bro? She sound annoying as shit. I'm so incredibly bored. I don't know why I thought this challenge was gonna be a little more fun, but dude, like, I'm actually bored and I'm actually ready to go to bed. Like, it's almost 1 a.m. Let's play some cards. This is my Rick and Morty Uno. I'ma deal y'all in, all right? Here go y'all cards. I have some good cards, bruh. And don't try to peek, bruh. Chill. Let's go ahead and pick a card from the deck. Blue six. I got an eight. Your turn. Why are you not going? This is sad. Did I think y'all was going to play back? Or I'm not understanding. I knew I was delusional, but this is a little bit much. I'm not going to lie. So we can just say that I won. We can just say that I won and we can call it even. Just say that I won. Say that I won, bro. I want to do like a mini fashion show kind of thing um, where I try on some outfits. Now, I don't really have a lot of outfits that are different aesthetics. So I'm going to try my very best. Um, You know, fashion show. Why not try on some clothes? You know, that would be pretty fun. I look oily as shit. Like, I really need to do my skincare and take a shower but but i'm not taking a minute ass shower so i'm just gonna have to shower tomorrow when this challenge is over so i think i'm gonna try to do like emo god type of aesthetic business woman business I'm, i work at a corporate office and a surprise one which is gonna just be like random like the most random combination of clothes like the most random outfit i could possibly put on yeah is this a little bit childish probably but this is just how i am and i want to entertain myself so this will be wrong with y'all but this will be wrong like like, it, it's probably people that's thinking, damn, you're 23 years old, you're doing shit like, grow up. I hate when people tell me to grow up, bro, because this is my thing. I am not childish in the aspect of serious situations. A serious situation, I can be serious. Get the bills paid, get the rent paid, get everything handled in that aspect. I just like to be a little goofy and have fun, dude. And I don't even want to sound like a pick me when I say that. But, like, people need to learn to live a little, bro. You're never too old to do silly, stupid shit that a kid would do. AKA why I have a trampoline in my apartment. It just reminds me that it doesn't matter how much older i'm getting i can still do stupid shit honestly like especially now that i live alone it's like inner child who was restricted because if y'all don't know i have adopted siblings my mom adopted a bunch of kids and it was just like a house full of us and i feel like i was a bit restricted in a way because she had to like pay for everybody you get what i'm saying like it's not like i was the only child and i could just have like the the 
childhood dream. It was just a lot of us and my mom made do with what she could. And I had a great childhood, but I wasn't like doing fun childhood things, if that makes sense, because there was so much of us. So it was really just like, I wouldn't say it was boring, but we made our own fun, if that makes sense. So now that I'm older, I feel like it's so cool of me to just buy random things and do random activities impulsively and go random places, like buy toys and shit like that, because I wasn't really able to do that. I hope y'all get what I'm saying. But anyway, let's have a fashion show. I'm gonna do the emo outfit first, and then we're gonna do the business cash, and then the random outfit. Let me know your fave. One, two, or three. Oh, this is such, this is so comfy cozy. Jingle Bell is tired, though. I'm sorry. Every time I move, I'm tired of hearing. I'm just doing too much. Let me chill, bro. Because <laughs> this is great. No. I've been sitting here listening to Party Next Door, y'all. Can the challenge be over, dude? Look at the time. Four o'clock in the morning, bro. Can this shit be over? Secondly, I was getting ready to do my skincare. That's why my face looks so dry. And I remembered I had to do it on camera and do it in one minute. Uno momento, so much time. I really just have to put my products on. I think I could do that in a minute. I'm not gonna lie. I'm tired, like I got my PJs on now. Tell me these pajamas don't give you Japanese denim, like the Bath and Body Works scent. Y'all, I feel like this challenge was pretty cool. Pretty cool challenge. I don't know what else I would do. Like this is around the time I would actually go to sleep. Y'all, I love when old people vlog like that sounds random as shit but there was a girl on my recommended one day and it was like the 30s vlog wait 30s is not old let me just correct myself 30s is not old but a lot of adults feel like like they want to do youtube and stuff and they always feel like oh, i'm too old for that stuff i'm too old for that stuff like no you're not bro and the girl's video was so like dope like the video was so dope and her personality was so vibrant like let me see if i can find her actually her name is janae daily j-n-a-y daily shout out to her because her video came up on my recommended and i had to subscribe because i just love her videos but yeah a lot of people i'm saying that like i'm like 16 dude i'm 23 years old i'm approaching that number bro i'm approaching but a lot of Older people be feeling like they can't do social media because they feel like they're too old for it. And 30s is so young. Being in your 30s is young as shit. But I'm saying like even if you were like 40 or 50. Because there's this guy with like a gray beard, long gray hair that I saw on YouTube as well the other day. And he made like a cooking kind of vlog. But it was like edited really nicely. And I'm like, okay. I'm pretty sure this speech ain't gonna target any of y'all because majority of my audience that watches me are younger than me But I love when I get comments of people like oh, I'm 25 and I look up to you or like oh, I'm 26 and you make me want to go out and just you know live my life and make you're making me realize that I'm not too old to have fun and do silly stuff like how you do and I love that so bad speaking of silly stuff Let's learn how to do a handstand. I'm a handstand genius. I've been doing handstands my whole life Number one tip on how to do a handstand look up a YouTube tutorial. Okay all right, I know some of these words. Try kicking up into the full handstand using a wall to help. Girl, what the fuck? You want my back to break? My spine finna be tender. It can't possibly be that hard, dude. It literally can't. Go like this and put your foot on the wall. Ow! Ah! You're weird as shit. I'm not that strong. Dude, I can't do it. I'm not that strong. Arms up. What the fuck? That lady on the video lied. She made it seem like it was easier. I'm about to leave her a comment. Oh, she turned the comments off. Oh, why the comments off, Anna? Turn the comments on. I just want to leave a suggestion, Anna. Just something real quick just to, like, brighten your day. Let me tell y'all what I would have said. Anna, don't fucking lie. That shit ain't easy peasy lemon squeezy like you're portraying it to be. I'm not going to thumbs down because you're pretty. But next time, do a few more steps for the people in the back. I don't need the extra help because I've been doing handstands since I was five since I was DS, but some people don't understand how to do these things, Anna. So please make it a little easier for the beginners. Thank you. Maybe I'll just DM it to her. Bitch, you're lying! You're fucking lying! That was not a minute! I was 
done anyway, real shit. All I had to do was put that moisturizer on, bro. I would go in and put Aquaphor on and all but dumbass timer wanted to go off, bro. Remember earlier in the video when I was packing things in my bag and I was like, oh, what do I need to bring in my snack bag? Aquaphor. Aquaphor on the lashes a bit and on the brows. Thin layer on the skin. That's my skincare. It's five o'clock in the morning. First of all, why am I even up? This is not an all nighter, dude. It's literally not an all nighter. Finna catch some Z's, y'all. I'm actually really tired. Deuces, peace and love. There's nothing else to say because I do this every day. And you know I'm the one and I don't play. She belong to the city. All right, bro, I'm going to sleep for real, for real. I'm turning the camera off. Bro, I don't even want to be on camera right now, bro. I sound dead. It is 1.42 in the afternoon. Before I close off this vlog, I just want to say thank you guys for watching. I'm gonna go back to sleep, I'm not gonna lie. Deuces.